Greetings. I want to see the Alliance map. What awaits in Yorkshire? Halfton Ragnarsson, Conqueror of the North, sends his greeting. He wishes to meet with Eivor Wolfkist personally. Halfton Jarl. I've heard that man's name so often, I feel as though I know him already. He is currently entangled in a war with the Picts of the Northern Hills. I suspect he wants your counsel, or your axe. If you are keen to meet him, he asks that you join him at his war camp. I have the location here. With caution, Eivor. Yervikshire is currently at war with the Picts, a proud clan that lives just beyond the Roman Wall. Need your eyes, my friend. <laughs> Cast about this lamp, my friend. Well met, Eivor Ravenfren. Now there's a face I've seen before. Part of it. We met in Jorvik, the Yuletide feast. The Yuletide massacre. I remember. What brings you here? Halfton Jarl. He summoned me. Is he near? He was, but the Picts hit us hard. We were separated. Fresh attack from the hills. Watch your back! Picts. They won't be happy to see the likes of me.
Are you wounded? I'll live. If we die today, tonight we drink with Odin. Either way, we claim victory! Once again. I've done Ragnarsson. We met in the forge of battle. Surely a good sign. I don't know you. One of Farrowit's new dogs? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor, yes. Down in Mercia. Kingmaker with my brothers Ivar and Uba, and Finir in East Anglia. From the tales I hear, I feared you might be taller. That's not a fear you feel often, I imagine. So you answered my summons. <laughs> the timing is poor, as you can see. Too many here are spent, battle sore, thirsty. Faravid, have your men build field pyres for the dead. At once, my yard. Not here, not now. Then to Donna Castor for a victory feast! The oldest son of Ragnar Lothbrook, so he says. What do you make of him? Heroic display. He makes a powerful first impression. Just the way he likes it. Welcome to Jorvikshire, friend. Well met, Faravid. I was hoping your Jarl would be as welcoming, but I suppose I must earn his trust. Is that why you've come here? To earn Hafton's trust? To find a seat at his table? I have my own table. What I want is a bond of friendship between the new lords of England. Among whom you count yourself, I suppose? It is an ally I seek, not a master. Well, there is but one lord of Northumbria. Roman giants outdid themselves with this fortress. <laughs> Where would Hafton Jarl hold court? Sneaky lot, masters of guile and ambush. Have a care, eat of a bondage. Meren Summer of the Ina, in our Ultima Pula, don't they? Please, Lady Ruth, my wife grows ill. I will attend to her soon, I promise. We crush them in spring. No sooner. That is the plan. Yet my people suffer day by day. Your people? This war must end. That is my first concern. The time to strike is... when is... I say we strike. Aftad's hammer protects this land. Tell my people that. King, we 
this year. As you wish, my lord. Who is this? Come closer. Avdan Ragnarsson. Your sword arm answers your call. Thank you for your tribute, Eivor Wolfkist. Your battles and deeds are well known to me. And you are the hero of Yorick. So sing my skulls. Not just any hero. Eivor brought order to the city when King Rishia could not. They say you rooted out a gang of thieves and traitors. Not alone, but I led the charge. You gifted my servant to the cards and tales of Yorick. To men and women who needed it most. A foolish choice. The coin never left King Rishia's treasury. I try never to regret the decisions I made in a time of war. Agreed. To second guess ourselves would only stall the victory. I don't regret sending Ferovid to lead our strike against the Pates, in spite of Eivor winning the day. Eivor and I killed them, Hafdan Jarl, so you could sweep in, stab a few cold corpses, and claim a glorious victory. <laughs> Old friend, your jests hit like Odin's spear, always on the mark. I would not be here without your hammer, my dear. Please accept this, your share of the loot we won today. A thing of beauty. Frankish, I believe. What do you think, Eivor? A fine piece of work, fit for the lips of a king. Or a man who makes kings. There's wisdom in this one, Faravid. By your leave, Lord, I must return to my forward camp. It's a long, cold ride. Summons, you said. Okay, not now. Dance, sing, fill yourself with air, and meet me take this tower of stone. There I will weave a tale of friendship and treachery. A tale as old as the world. Thought nuns dressed like geese. Nothing of the sort. I am Moira of Weka, Hafton's herbalist. He is an ill man, and I do what I can to give succor and hope. I saw him fight. He was in fine health then. Thanks in part to my soothing tonics. Would you pardon me? It's a long war in winter. Test the speed of Fair warning, Joe. My fists have hammered nails and strangled sharks. Still care to brawl? 
Swift and strong you may be. It's the one most righteous who wins the fight. Where are they gone now? I must comfort you fought well, warrior, but here your legend ends, bound to no name. Survey the area, Sudan. Swing an axe. Can you lift a horn? As Thor swallowed the oceans, I can lift many horns and drain them too. A bold claim. I'll drink to. Dane, try your luck at throwing bones. My luck overspills like the ocean's tide. Only fate will keep me from winning. Then come and see. What fate do these dice hold for you? Interesting.
This will do. Top the Tower of Stone, he said. Dogs do not yearn to be yards, but I... Ah, Eivor. Come, let me show you our wonder. Conquered this, he and I, together. You have earned great fame, won many battles across England. I'm not alone. No, no. Bjorn Ironside, fearless Uber, Ivar the Boneless, Sigurd Snake and I, great warriors all, my brothers. Gold is good, and battle better, but glory never dies. 
Forever it lives in the Hall of Heroes, high on Valor's steed. Together we have conquered. Together with my friends, my clan. Faravid, above all others. One sword is not an army, Eivor. Even a hero needs loyal friends. I have never lost sight of that. Never. Have you room for one more among those you call friend? What does friendship mean to you, Eivor? Friendship goes beyond words. It's a solemn bond, a chain unbroken. Spoken like the Voler, it is indeed a kind of magic. You wriggle like an eel in a basket, Hafton. What has caught you? Friendship can also spoil, like rotten meat. After all these years, he dares to bite my hand. Fan of it. He seems a good and loyal man. Seems, yes. As a bright sky in winter seems warm. But rumors fly of little men plotting treason in the dark. Have you proof of his treachery? Not yet. That is where you enter my saga. Prove this for me. Discover if... Faravid has been disloyal. Then we shall talk of oaths. Start me somewhere. Give me something to go on. You see this from a sea unicorn. I filter my mead and wine with it. I've heard of such beasts. They swim below the ice, beyond the world's edge. And their horns protect against poison. You believe Faroin wants to poison you? I fear he has tried countless times and failed them all. You don't believe me, but I know the man. His gifts of wine, his easy smile, his envy, his plots. Learn the truth. Dig up. <coughs> Unearth his treason. Why trust me with such a task? Jorvik, you stopped the ill deeds of Auden and his swarm of rats. You can do the same here. Like a good sword, honor has two edges. I'll help you. Faravid has left the feast already, heading for his camp upriver. Join his warband. And behind his back, dig. And if I find nothing? If he's a good and loyal man. Even better. Even better. Fair enough. I'll find what I find, then return, my friend. Don't let Farouet fool you. He is hiding something. Fancy one, sitting up in Hampton's tower.
Must be fat of its camp ahead. <sighs> what do you see, Sunan? Cold and dirty must be the place. Throw yourself in, Gunungagap, you bastard! I am not a dog! Yet here. Part of it. Ah, Eivor, my friend. Is Donacaster hospitality to your liking? I would be careful calling this one friend, Faravid. The crow who comes flapping when Haftan gives a whistle. Haftan and I spoke, and what of it? This is our fight, our chance for glory. Fly on home, crow. Lend me a knife, Faravid. This whelp needs gelding. Over piss off. Small men always talk big. So was Hafton generous? Did you get what you came for? If I help with your fight against the Picts, Hafton will consider me a friend. So point the way, Fadavid. The Picts raided that monastery, plundered its silver and gold. The Saxons build more churches than barns, and fill them with herds of monks. Yes, monasteries make tempting targets. And not just for us, we tracked Pictish raiders heading north. Gold is fine, but victory is our treasure. What's your plan? To open their bellies with my knife. I'm ready to fight. Let's put them in the ground. Halfdan didn't send you north to fight a skirmish we could win with half our numbers. Why are you here, Eivor? You question my word. You never gave it. Then I give you my word, Faravid. I am here to fight Picts. To arms, dogs! Let's roast some Picts! Yeah! Watch for ambushes. Should have stayed in Donacastre. More meat, fewer Picts. There's no glory in guard duty. Move out! The Picts are just ahead. Lead the way, and we'll watch your back. Enough fooling. These Picts are a sneaky lot. Masters of guile and ambush. Have a care.
Thanks, Thor, we made it. This cave is a passage. The Pecs are using it to cross the mountain. A gift for us. You track them through the cave. We'll circle around back and snare any who try to slip away. Says, I should be home filling my belly. Not mucking about on the wrong side of the wall. Ah, boil your head. We'll gang forth with our friends soon and then we'll all eat like kings. Heed my words. Wrong side of the wall.
much this winter with help from an unknown quarter. The Picts spoke of Stenway, their camp. That's to the north. Their chief may be there. Dead! Run! Stop them before they reach Stenway! They spotted us! Run forward! Run. Faster! They Faster! Ultra! Ultra! Glory for Ultra! South of the wall. That's the last one. The Picts don't raid often during winter. The scouts are dead. The Picts won't know we're here. The Hornets have led us to their nest. More than a chief up there. Looks like the forward camp of an army. But would the Picts dare attack in winter? Hafton thinks not. And the Picts may use that to their advantage. Let's find out. make war in winter. They must have a reason, something to gain. Best not to draw attention here. Now, to hunt down the big chief.
That's the chief. Now just strike him down. Huh. 
Have you come to join you? side of the giant's wall, friend. Have you come to make war in winter? <laughs> Fool, he might have talked. We got what we came for. Is that more Frankish wine? I'll take a few casks. And that silver there. Ofer, that's Hafton's share. Eivor, just in time to divide the spoils. Take some meat if you like. The Picts are Magnus. This map spells it out. Ah, the wolf kissed is a reader. That stark satyr I'll never mess with. Worry about the Picts later. Now's the time for treasure and spoils. You earn it. It should be ours. We did the work. All of it. And nothing for half done. Warming his cock in a Saxon castle. Open that cask and we'll have a taste. We'll celebrate together. Sorry, friend, but that's Hafton's take. You understand. You won't notice one missing cask. So unless there's something wrong with it, let's have a taste. There's nothing wrong with it, friend. If you insist, we'll all drink some stinking wine. A little sour, but not bad. I've always preferred ale myself, or spiced meat. What I won't drink is one of Moira's herbal brews. She claims they're a tonic, but there's no telling what she hides in those drinks. Moira? I met her at the feast. She's a herbalist from the north, always skulking in the shadows of Hafton's throne. It's a big throne. Don't you all skulk around it from time to time? Why all these doubts, Eivor? You're a warrior, not a rumor monger. Doubt is too strong a word. But there is a feeling of mistrust among you. I want this alliance to be ironclad. Then let me change your mind. I've got a plan to win this war for good before the winter sets in. Magnus is a strong fort, but we'd be attacking from the south. With speed, we'll catch them off guard. With Halfton's blessing, I'd fight beside you anywhere. Name the time and place. No, Hafton is done fighting for the winter. He thinks it too great a risk. But I say we can win this war before the next snow. If we tell him of this plan, he'll refuse. But if we succeed, you and I together, he'll sing our praises all the louder. There are no secrets in this world, or the next. The Old Father sees everything. We need not fear Odin's eye, only Hafton's wrath. I must return to Dunacasper for a time, but I will join you for this battle. Deliver this goblet to my Jarl, he has a fondness for them, and tell him his share of the spoils is coming. When you're ready, find me near Jorvik at a place called the Walls. He shrinks up in each victory, like his cock, eh?
of many, but most walk about with heads that are empty. Hey, you! My eyes and soul do not deceive me. You are the wolf. Slow sips, Halfton. It helps the brew stay down. Drink the rest. Yes, yes. Thank you, Moira. That is all for now. The soothing herbs lift the fog from my mind for a time. How long has she been mixing these for you? You're stalling, Eivor. Tell me what you've learned. What news from the north? The Picts were beaten back. We took their lives and their treasures. Part of it asked me to deliver this. Is he taunting me? Faravid poisons the wine he gives me. These goblets are a cruel joke. He is mocking me. We did capture some barrels of Frankish Black. He said they were for you, but I made him open a cask. We drank together. There was no poison. Speak without guise, Eivor. Does he plot against me, or no? Does he keep secrets? Give me something I can use. Now you must choose between treason and madness. Between the serpent's fang and the bite of a rabbit wolf. Faravid asked for my silence. Halfton expects the truth. If I'm not careful, these lies will pile up, one upon the next. You have grown awfully silent, Wolfkist.
Part of it has planned an attack on the Picts at Martins. Without you. That twin-faced, backstabbing glory eater! When? Tell me. I won't know until we meet again. At a place called the Walls. Good. Go to him. Watch, listen. Unearth his lies. You will find them. If you fear poison, Lord, you must consider everything. Even Moira's brew. Impossible. Moira has been with me for an age. She is no witch. She is kind. Perhaps you could speak with her and find out for yourself. She stays within Donacaster, not far from here. If you learn something, find me north of Donacaster. One of my scouts there has troubling news. Heal, Veltop! I'm going for a walk down to the temple. <laughs>